Welcome again to this exciting moment. We are going to be looking at uh, some great things that are really a transformation in the lives of many people that have worked in my life and uh, the life of so many people out there. The six steps to success in life. The six steps to success in life. You know, success have steps. And for you to be successful in whatever you do, whether you are a pilot, whether you are a medical doctor, whether you are a networker, whether uh, uh, you are an artist, for you to succeed, there are some things that you have to do. And that is why this morning I will be talking briefly on the six steps, the six steps to success in life. So one of the steps, if you really want to succeed in life, is that you have to set goals. You have to set goals. You have to have objectives. What is your goal for this month? What is your goal for this week? What is your goal for this day? So you have to set goals. You need to set targets. For example, let's say people like us that we are networkers, let's say next month, last month, you recruited 10 people into your business. And you can set a goal that this month, I'm going to recruit 20 people or 30 people or 100 people. So you have to set goals. You have to set objectives if you want to be too successful. So setting goals is not just to say that I want to do this, I want to do that. No, you have to need to have a book and you have to have a pen so that you write down every goal that you want to accomplish in your life. So that is, the, that is what you have to do. The first thing you have to do, the first thing to success in life is that you have to set goals. You need to have goals. You need to have objectives. You need to be able to uh, decide that you are going to be wealthy and that you are going to achieve that dream. The second step, the second step of success in life is that you need to develop a mental toughness. You need to develop a mental toughness. What does that mean? That means that whatsoever you are carrying on as a project, you have to be tough. Your mental mind has to be tough. Because for you to accomplish your dream and to be something bigger, you cannot afford uh, to have a small mind. You cannot afford to have a weak mind. Because those with weak minds cannot develop their potentials. Those with weak minds cannot succeed. So for you to have adequate success, you need to develop your mental toughness. And that is done by you reading books. You have to read books on motivation. You have to read books on self-development. You have to read books on uh, uh, success and so many other things that are, we, we edify your spirit and makes you more proactive. So you have to read books. You have to do things. You have to study. That is how you develop a mental toughness towards your success. That is why you develop. So the, the, the third thing you have to do if you want to be successful, you have to build a growth mindset. We say the first thing is set a goal. The second thing, develop mental toughness. The third thing is that build a growth mindset. Your mindset needs to be built. You need to be focused on growth. You must not be limited on, on, on stagnant mindset. You must be able to know that you can accomplish your dreams. So your mind needs to be developed in growth. You must work towards growth. You must work towards your objective to achieve your dreams. So you must develop your growth mindset. Let your mindset grow. Right? You need to set big targets. You need to have bigger dreams. So develop your mindset. The fourth thing you have to do is develop your willpower. You have to develop your willpower. What is willpower? Willpower is the ability to be able to go for that thing no matter what happened. To be able to stand for that your dream, for that your project, no matter what happened. So develop your willpower. Develop your will toughness. Develop your willpower. So that is the fourth thing you have to do. Develop your willpower. The fifth thing you have to do if you have to acquire success and to succeed in this world, don't be afraid of competition. Don't fear competition. I know in your industry or what you do, there are a lot of competitors. Us and networkers, we have a lot of competitors. We have a lot of companies with excellent products. We have a lot of companies that are out there also to, to be able to have a lot of customers. So there are a lot of competition. But don't be afraid of your, of your competitors because when you, when you put your goals and your projects into action, 
you will be able to obtain the success required. Success is for everybody. So it does not matter the domain. It does not matter the competition around you. You will be able to obtain the success you desire. And, and some people, people like us in network marketing, some will look at their upline and say, oh, my upline is far. I'm working for my upline. No, you don't work for your upline. That is another way to, to defeat competition. You don't work for your upline. You work for yourself. So whatsoever you do, don't be afraid of competition. Because the world we are living in is full of competitors. But you have to know that your own star has a place in the sky. So don't be afraid of competition. That is a feed point if you want to be successful, if you have to move towards success. So we are talking about the six steps to success in life. So we say the first one is that set a goal. The second one is that develop mental toughness. The third one is that build a growth mindset, right? The fourth one, develop your willpower. And the fifth is don't fear competition. So the last point, if you want to develop, if you want to move towards success, the steps to success is challenge yourself. You have to challenge yourself, right? Stop setting limited goals. Stop saying that I'm going to, uh, uh, my, my, my business, I will make, uh, let's say, $10,000, 10,000 francs today. No, you have to set higher goals. You have to go for millions. You have to say this month, I'm going to achieve 5 million. This month, I'm going to have 10 million as profit. This month, I'm going to have 20 million, 100 million as profit. Set higher goals. Set higher goals. Don't set limited goals. This month, I'm going to sell this and this product. This month, I'm going to do this. So your goals and your objective need to be higher. Challenge yourself. Challenge yourself onto success. Don't set limited goals. Challenge yourself. Challenge yourself. You can make it. You can make it big. Last month you did better, but this month you can do more. So challenge yourself in every step in life and in every step in whatsoever you are doing and whatsoever your career. You must challenge, challenge yourself to be greater. So those are the six steps. If you want to be successful in this life, you have to put them into practice. So we're talking about the six steps to success in life. And I wish you success. And wait for our next video. Don't forget to subscribe and share in this video. And our next video, we're going to talk a lot of things about success, your career, and how you can make it so easily in life. Thank you for watching. Thank you.